Yo, what's up guys? Mark from Wonderbrick Souls, back with a new video. Um, continuation of the final series, this is the letter T, and um, let's give it a go. 11 records to show you, so um, I'm gonna go pretty fast through the stack, otherwise well, the video will be huge. Um, first up, new wave of British metal, heavy metal. Um, this is Tank with Filth Hounds of Hades. Um, at least in the 80s, um, really nice, uh, yeah, heavy metal, really great stuff. Labels and the record is just black, so that's nothing special on that, no lyric sheet or whatever, just plain simple. Um, old school heavy metal. Um, yeah. Nothing strange um, to notice here. There are, there are some versions with another cover, a darker cover and stuff like that, but I've just got this version. This is an um, Dutch pressing? I don't know. Um, maybe. Um, anyways, Tank with Phil of Hounds of Hades. Really nice album. Go check it out if you haven't already. Next up is some grindcore from the Netherlands. This is Steve Grinder with Nihilism. Really awesome album. Comes on a gatefold. Labels. And this comes on black vinyl as well. A really nice band, um, not straightforward all, straight all the time, of course, there are a lot of moments that they are straightforward, but they also do some other stuff to make it more interesting. Um, great band, I think it's the second album, if I'm not mistaken, could be wrong, but uh, anyways, uh, really great album. Chief Grinder with Nihilism. Next up is some... Uh, black metal, Terzai de Horde with um, a rage of rapture against the dying of the light. And this is, if I'm not mistaken, an EP. Great stuff. Gatefold. Labels. And this one comes on heavy black vinyl. Yeah, nothing uh, a lot of to say. This is just a grind of a black metal band you have to hear. Um, pretty great stuff. Hope I went it once back in because it's a pain in the ass already. And that's not because of the record, but because of the sleeve. It's pretty thin sleeve that comes with it. Maybe gonna replace that one day, I don't know. Uh, great album, Tazai de Horde with a, rapture of, a Rage of Rapture Against the Dying of the Light. Really awesome cover as well, really like it. Great stuff. Next up is some old school first metal. This is Testament with The Legacy. Great album, nice condition, really great, great stuff. This is another reissue that's an early press and it still looks amazing. In the sheet, and it comes on black vinyl. Amazing band, amazing album. It's definitely one of the better albums they have. Um, not that they have a lot of bad albums, but um, this is one of my favorite. Over the Wall, Burnt Offerings, uh, First Strike, Still Deadly. Great, great, great songs. Testament with The Legacy. Next up is um, The Souls of Black by Testament. It's a later album, really cool cover I think, 
Also a pretty good album, nice diversity and um, really nice songs on it. In a sheet and the lyrics. With the classic Atlantic logo, logo on the labels. What the fuck is the insides are here. Heavy black vinyl. This is a reissue, uh, but it's a great, great, greatly done. Source of black by Testament. Next up is more Testament, of course. This is the latest album, uh, Brotherhood of the Snake. Really fantastic cover here. Really dig this album as well. This one comes on double vinyl labels. And both records are on black vinyl. Yeah, not much to say about this band. This band is legendary. Every trash fanatic knows this band. So, uh, yeah. Testament the Brotherhood of the Snake. And this is uh, 20. 16 release, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, 2016 release. Great, great album. Then we have some old tunes. This is Thin Lizzy with Life and Dangerous. Awesome live album. Definitely one of the better live albums that exists. And if you know the band, then you don't have to tell you everything. Labels is a really old pressing. Um, you can already see here it's getting uh, the white is getting um, change of color, so that's how old it is. Great stuff, of course, black vinyl. Like I said, really old pressing, uh, classic tunes on this um, Emerald, Oban, Rosalie. Um, the Massacre, Still in Love with You, Johnny Fo uh, the Fox Meet Jimmy the Weed, um, Boys Are Back in Town, um, yeah, really great songs. Check it out guys, awesome stuff, awesome tunes. Oh, why it does it? I don't spin this uh, very often, but if I spin it, I really enjoy this. Great, great stuff. Thin Lizzy Life and Dangerous. Classic in the old rock, hard rock genre. Great stuff. Next up is Tiamat with the Sumerian Cry. Yes, completely something different again. Awesome album, classic debut of this band from Sweden if I'm not mistaken and this one comes on a white vinyl and gatefold lyrics and pictures awesome band they're now a gothic band, but this is really gothic, this is more death black stuff. Um, the early days where they were more raw. And if you like more raw, then this is the album to check out by this band, Samir and Cry by Tiamat. Next up, some black metal from the Netherlands. This is Studia with Dor, a debut. Uh, EP Great stuff
in a sheet with the band members and a bitch on the other side. Labels comes on black vinyl. But this is an amazing band guys. If you don't know Turia, Turia go check it out. Uh, if you're a black metal fan, this is really great, great stuff. Female vocalist, but has amazing screams. Great band, Tulia with Door. And over to the last three records already. Um, this is Tokyo Blade with Tokyo Blade. Yes, again, some new ways of British heavy metal. Oh. I will need. Hey, I have more. great stuff. All nice classic 80s stuff here. Black vinyl. Great, great bands. Fantastic album, Tokyo Blade with Tokyo Blade. Definitely one of the best albums they have released. Great stuff. Next up, more Tokyo Blade. This is Madame Guillotine, Guillotine and 12 inch EP. Labels Black Final. Fantastic condition this old record is and really glad that it's that condition. Glad that there are some new, real music lovers that they take good care of the albums. Um, and I'm really glad they do. Now you can enjoy the old heavy metal classics. Still, some are re uh, reissued of course but not all the old albums and yeah. So it's glad I have this in a good condition. Metal Guillotine by Tokyo Blade. And the last, oh, I've got two records even. <laughs> I didn't look very well. Um, this is Tigers of Tang Tang with Crazy Nights. Amazing album. Labels. Black vinyl, of course, no inner sheet or whatever, just the record. And that's the way they did it uh, in the back in the day. The credits and stuff are on the back of the album, and there's not, that's also the case with this one. Stuff like that is also on the back, and labels, of uh, labels, front cover, really amazing cover. Great album. Next up and the final one, yes, now it's the final one. It's not a, it's a record I not show I showed not so long ago. This is Tiger of Pantang with the cage. Great stuff. Not the best album, but enjoyable. Oh, this one comes with a printed in the sleeve. And labels. And black final. Great, great album. Um, like I said, not their best album, but um, yeah, great stuff. Got some songs like Rendezvous, uh, for example, Love Potion number nine. That are the most well known songs on this one. Great stuff. The case by Tigers of Hang Tang. And that's the stack for today. Um, all the teas. Um, next up will be the use. Um, yeah. I would like to thank you for watching, liking and supporting guys. I really appreciate it. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, the records I have in my collection for the letter T. And um, hope to see you guys soon. And... Uh, Thank you, take care and have a nice day.